Hey guys, what's going on? Russo here bringing you guys a brand new player review today. And today, guys, we're going to be bringing you the second Inform Jermaine Defoe review. But before we get into the video, if you guys are interested in purchasing any coins, make sure you guys go ahead and check out ufifa.com. All the links will be in the description below. And please make sure to use the discount code Russo for 5% off if you guys do end up purchasing any coins. So, today, guys, we are doing the second Inform Defoe, as I just mentioned. Now, most of you guys do know that Team of the Season is over, and most of the bigger leagues in the world are over. Over as well so the remaining team of the weeks are going to be pretty poor a lot of MLS players will be featured in them a lot of Liga de Brazil players from what I've seen at least in this recent team of the week and a default obviously is in the MLS you guys all know that he plays for Toronto so he was only 25,000 coins for a second in form so not really too bad of a price 85 pace guys 83 dribbling 89 shooting some very good stats for him 44 defense 61 passing and 71 heading um, like I mentioned before he did only cost 25,000 coins nine goals in six games guys and I actually did lose a game of footage so my apologies so I only have about seven goals that uh, I can sh actually show you guys when we do into the in-game footage meaning medium work rates he is right footed uh, preferred and we'll kind of get to that in a little bit uh, there was something pretty interesting I found out about him uh, when I was playing with him so three star weak foot and three star skill moves as well and he is extremely small guys he's only five foot seven and uh, when you do actually play with him in game his body statue is just so much smaller than everybody else it's uh, almost kind of frustrating so anyways guys in game stats 96 finishing so a very good uh, finishing 93 long shots as well I did attempt a few long shots with him most of them you know 90 95% of them were right on target and as some of them even almost did go in so 96 shot power as well and 91 volley so three star weak foot and three star skill moves like I did mention before medium medium work rates which did pose a little bit of a problem but for the most part Defoe made his runs and did everything um, that you would expect out of a striker 91 agility guys 97 balance one of the best stats on this card obviously that comes with the fact that he's extremely small and very agile and can move around the pitch um, and also has really good you know control of the ball and a pretty decent control of his dribbling as well he does have 83 dribbling on his card so that's definitely a pretty decent stat so one of the things that I did want to mention to you guys so when I was playing with this player he seemed to always try to get the shot off on his right foot now there is a trait in FIFA that uh, it's called like prefer strong foot all the time and they'll try to shoot it you know they'll try to shoot any shot they can with their right foot even when you know the ball is perfectly placed on his left foot ready to finesse it into the goal he would do an outside the foot um, shot with his right foot so really really strange uh, so it was kind of difficult to so score some goals with his left foot but the uh, kind of hybridization that I did with him to get him into a squad he was placed at the left striker position so obviously his right foot was inside so when he was cutting inside uh, we could utilize his right foot so if you guys do want to see that team make sure you guys do let me know uh, in the comment section below really really cool team that I actually ended up coming with and uh, it played very well to be honest the defense was a little shaky um, really not a big fan of Buffon I had Buffon in net uh, but anyways guys so Defoe was a very good player I mean 25,000 coins for a second in form is very very good like I mentioned before you know if you guys want to go ahead and re-watch the uh, in-game clips you could just tell comparing Defoe's you know character I guess in game compared to all these other bigger players he is very very small he is a you know he's pretty strong I'm not gonna say he's very strong obviously he's only five foot seven uh, which makes him you know somewhat weak but he can kind of fight with the defense but a lot of the times if you're facing these big name defenders like you know team this season Chiellini anything like that uh, he kind of does get destroyed but his pace kind of makes up for that uh, slightly in you know variation so nonetheless guys a very good player for what you're getting for 25,000 coins he's absolutely brilliant the only problem is obviously he is in the MLS and at the MLS yeah it does have some very good players it does lack you know very good players all around the pitch so it is kind of difficult to hybrid him up but I was able to do it and I uh, made a really really cool squad so if you guys want to see that squad make sure this video hits 50 likes and I will actually upload that squad for you guys tomorrow so thank you all for watching so much hopefully you guys did enjoy this review of the second informed Defoe. I would give him a 9 out of 10 I really did enjoy playing with him uh, nine goals in six games not too bad of a ratio and also he's well worth only 25,000 coins so thank you all for watching once again let's get this video to 50 likes until next time guys this has been yourself and have a good one